Wow. Fool me once, shame on you. But you're not going to fool me twice. So, hello everyone, this is Dead Man Matador, and today I have purposely leaked my information to this guy, Mr. Thomas. So here's what happened. This all started with someone I used to call a friend. I don't call him a friend now, because not only he, he betrayed my trust, but he realized that he was literally scamming me, he, or whatever he was doing, and basically defriended me. So anyway, he told me that my account was being pinned on ban. I don't know what for, I don't know what reason, but I decided to take a look at the Steam support. And it turns out I wasn't. And I sh I should have. I should have listened to it. I should have trust the Steam support, because I was good. I did not have any sort of banning problems. Unfortunately, hey, that's not the case. However, I will say this for a fact. That even if he didn't and block me in any way, shape, or form, I wouldn't send out his information. He's lucky that I don't. But what I will show is Mr. Thomas here, right? Because this guy has a record of having trade bans, right? He was banned for trading. He also has a communication ban. Yeah, he's been banned for the community, and he's been banned for trading. And on top of that, not only he stole two items from me, for the t in Fortress 2, but he literally stole my account, because I literally gave this guy I my account, account name, and my password to this guy. And not only that, I gave my email address to this guy, and the password to it. And after two hours is later, I started feeling like an actual ass. I started feeling like an actual dumbass for not trusting the Steam page in the first place. That was okay, because because the moment I decided to do research on this guy, I found out him on the what is known as the Steam Rep page. Uh, yes, SteamRepHelp.com. And it turns out that this wasn't the first time he's done this. No, I am afraid it will be his last. But he always has two bands on him. So you know what? With this, after I sent the report, I hope this guy gets banned. Alright? This guy should not be on, on Steam. Unfortunately, there are people like him. So, let me keep my composure. There's a lesson to be learned out of all of this. And I want to show this profile for a reason. Alright? If you see this guy, if he's telling you things, or somebody's referring you to him, don't listen. Alright? Don't listen. Is it? Because what they're going to do is that they're going to steal your account information. Probably, probably to basically permanently, probably to steal all your games, all your information, and possibly steal your account number. Steal your, basically your debit card number, or your credit card number, or any type of card information. So yeah, lesson learned. If somebody's referring you to this guy, or this guy's contact to you, who just block him. Block all communication from him. him. But I want uh, to bring this out as a warning to anyone, right? Do not give out your... Do not give out any personal information. Your password, your account information, or anything. Right? I have learned my lesson. I have learned my lesson. And, and thank God, the only thing, the only thing, the only thing that I've lost... 
was two items, right? Two items from Team Fortress 2. And you know what? I am glad that that's the only thing that I've lost. Because by God, if I could get back on onto my Steam account, that's years. Years of money putting into games, of buying games, and then buying the editing software that I used to make YouTube videos. All that would have been gone in an instant. Had I not acted sooner, if I just let this, this be, it could have all been gone in an instant. So guys, again, this is a lesson. Don't give out personal information. And block any communication for somebody saying any otherwise. However, if you want to know if you have a vac bound on you, there's a way to find out. All you have to do is go to the Steam. You yet you go onto the actual Steam in website. Go to the support page. Type in vac. And if you if it says account in good standing, that means you're in the clear. Of course, I don't think ink of anybody who's getting a vac bag really doesn't care because they're breaking in the rules of the first place. So guys. Important lesson, all right? I'll leave. Uh, yeah. So, guys, important lesson: don't give out personal information. I've learned that the hard way, <clears throat> and I was lucky. But this is a lesson to be learned. I'll leave a link in the description below for the Steam actual website, all right? So that way you can check out uh, whether or not you have a back ban on you. And I'll also link in the description below for the Steam Rep page. It's because without them, I wouldn't be able to figure this out a lot sooner. So without any further ado, guys, hope you if you like this video, please give this a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, why not subscribe? Right. And also ring that bell for notifications. Yes. And please, guys. Your personal information is important to you. Do not give it away. And I will see you in the next video.